Hello again, this is Delta Climber coming to you from Delta Climber Studios, Roblox, Swordburst 2, and I tell you what, I'm, I'm going to have to upgrade my new T3 Greatsword, the Opposer, and take a break from the game. I, it just hurts my heart to every floor I go to to see not just one hacker, but on floor nine, there were four hackers on the main boss. Here I am on floor 11. There are two hackers on the trio. And at um, Hidden Wilds, hacker. Ectolomo Gloonlands, hacker. I mean, there's hackers on every floor. Of this game. And I tell you, I'm not here for you, boss, although I'm going to go ahead and do this boss while I'm here, waiting for the chest to respawn. My favorite game on Roblox, and I can't wait till Sword Burst 3 comes out. My son is going to get on it too, he says, and we're going to play it in Alpha. And... I sure hope they have figured out a way to stop the exploiters. The exploiting, man, that just really, really stinks. Yep, the chests are starting to respawn here. This is my favorite place. If you are a high enough level to be able to handle the monsters and the boss here, you can actually get the boss and steer him, be beating him up while you go and get these chests. All the chests on floor 11 are diamond level chests, and I get most of my upgrade protection scrolls from these chests. But man, they hide their names. I mean, they don't even conceal the fact that they're auto-farming, flying around hackers. They just, they used to have invisible hackers it was a problem. And you could find their little avatars laying around all over the game. But now it's just blatant and bold and they fly around and hack. So I hate that for the game. On the other floors, and, and hacking causes problems like glitching or bugging out bosses or doorways. You fall out of world when you do stuff that you shouldn't fall out of world. On the other floors, I couldn't even scroll my chat to see if I had gotten a upgrade protection scroll. So I'm just waiting for them to respawn. There's a huge circle of diamond chests. Here's the first one at the main boss here. And depending on what direction you start, I usually, it doesn't matter, I usually go Clockwise, this time I'm going counterclockwise, it doesn't matter. And again, if you're a high enough level, you can come down here and nobody else is here. And just steer the boss. All you got to do is just let him push you along and steer him and get the chest. There's another one back here. Oh, there's one way over there. Okay, I was going counterclockwise. And he's just pushing me. If you get underneath him, he can, you know, push you through the floor, make you fall out of world or whatever. And those other mobs. Oh, there's another person. That person is Rainbow from head to toe, Rainbow.
They're hitting 9,000. Yeah, the boss had him pinned down. Oh, the boss is still here? I thought he was through with them. How in the world? He's going to cause them to respawn back here. And that's why I want a T3. A T3 will hit 50 without curse. That's 100,000 with. 51 or something like that. But if you can catch a boss room by yourself, you can run these chests. I was hoping to get an upgrade protection scroll while we were sitting here. I was sitting here talking to you. But you just have to keep going around and going around until you get one. Got a rare... Choco Matril. Well, I don't even know what that means, but Choco Matril. Diamond Chess. Floor 11, Main Boss. Armor 200. He's speaking Spanish. I have level 200 armor. What do you have to trade? And I hope you don't mean legendary I don't even know if, is there a legendary yeah there's a legendary armor that's 200 I guess oh, he's back on the boss over there well I'm gonna come back over here and help this fellow I've got to go on this character to the baby and get the sword storm chain skill. I've got it on my main. This is my second main. And I did not realize how powerful that crazy little skill is. But it is super powerful. Come on, boss. Push, push. There's another chest. And this is what I do to get my upgrade protection scrolls. I just get the boss to push me along. You can see the kill aura is what I've heard it called a long time ago. Coming off of the boss. And there he goes. Oh, my super speed jump has been knocked off. That's all right. Finish. There we go. Finish that monster off. I'm going to stick around a little longer, kill a few more main bosses, and see if I can't get some more upgrade protection scrolls to upgrade this sword that I have made. Until next time, enjoy the game, play it straight. Please don't hack. It ruins the game for us normal players. It really does. But until then, arrivederci. This has been a Delta Glimmer Studio production.